Hey guys, welcome back. So today, I'm going to show you how to install Windows 11 on a PC that's not officially supported. Yep, no TPM, no secure boot, no supported CPU, and still, we're going to make it work like a charm. Right now, I'm running Windows 10 on this machine, and as you can probably guess, it fails every check Microsoft throws at it. But here's the good news. There's a neat little trick that lets us install Windows 11 without messing with the registry or hacking system files. Totally clean. Totally safe. And yes, you'll keep all your files and apps. Let's dive in. First things first. Head over to the Microsoft website. Scroll down to the Windows 11 ISO download section. Pick Windows 11 Multi-Edition ISO from the drop-down. Click Download, pick your language, and hit that 64-bit download button. The file's around 5 to 6 gigs, so yeah, make sure your Wi-Fi isn't acting up. Once it's downloaded, just right-click the ISO and hit Mount. That creates a virtual DVD drive for you. Easy. Open this PC and you'll see a new drive, something like DVD drive E or F, depending on your setup. Note that drive letter down, you'll need it in a sec. Next up, launch command prompt as administrator. In the black window, type your drive letter followed by a colon. For example, E. Hit enter. Now type this. setup.exe slash product server. Hit enter. Boom. That launches the Windows installer, but in server mode, which quietly skips all those annoying checks for TPM, CPU, and secure boot. And yeah, it'll say Windows Server for a bit. Don't panic, it's just a bypass. You're still installing full Windows 11, no strings attached. Hit Next, accept the license, and make sure Keep Personal Files and Apps is selected. Click Install and just chill while it does its thing. You'll probably see a screen saying, Installing Windows Server. Ignore it. That's just part of the trick. Behind the scenes, you're getting Windows 11. Once it's done, log back in. Press Windows plus R. Type Winver. Hit Enter. Boom! There it is. Windows 11, version 24H2, running smooth on hardware that wasn't supposed to work. That's how we do it. If this helped you out, drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and leave a comment if you got stuck anywhere. I've got your back. Catch you in the next one. Peace.